this morning. We are headed to Black Gold Golf Course in Sugar Creek, Ohio. Because they want a demo. I want to spray the whole thing, is what he said. Our goal is between 30 and 50,000 acres. Hey, how's it going? Mike with New Way Ag. This morning, we are headed to a golf course because they want a demo. They want to know how can these drones help them on this golf course. Don't really know what we're going to do. I asked him, like, how much are we spraying? He's like, I don't know. I want to spray the whole thing, is what he said. That's what we're going to do. We're going to take the New Way Ag trailer out there. We're going to do a demo with the T-50 just to see how well this technology can work for them on the golf course. So let's head out there and see what we get into. I definitely think that drones have a space in the golf course industry, like spraying golf courses and that type of thing. Because once you get your boundaries made, that's going to be saved into its memory. So if you have to go out and spray multiple different times, you can do that and it'll get that spraying knocked out for you on golf courses. So I'm really excited to see what it is that we're gonna be doing. Who knows? Let's go. All right, pulling up to the golf course now. Here we are, rolling up at the Black Gold Golf Course in Sugar Creek, Ohio. If you guys are looking for a cool place to go golfing in Amish country, come out here, check it out. Dude, check this out. Like, just beautiful out through there. I'm not a golfer. I know that that thing is pretty. Like this golf course, they put a lot of work in this thing to make it really nice. Pleasure to meet you. Yeah, that's a cool little setup you guys got there. Yeah, yep. we run off of that thing in Indiana covering thousands of acres. This year, we our goal is between 30 and 50,000 acres okay. in 30 days. What's the payload that you can one of those can carry? So it's a 10 and a half gallon tank, a lot of filling, a lot of battery swapping. The system we have set up there, you can run all day. The generator charges the battery as fast as it consumes it, so you can run all day long. Let's ride around. So you guys got a restaurant up there? Yep. Patio is all new addition. They built that in Idaho. Wow, that so that here. building's actually from Idaho. Yeah. Nice. So I wonder if the drone would work better for you because we can use the prop wash to blow it down and the like the grass will actually be blown around. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Right. And we got about 35 acres or so. We're in the process of adding a little bit more. Okay. Uh, and if we can keep it to where golfers can get in and find their golf ball. Hmm. and not slow up the round. That's what we're trying to uh, do. Okay. So that round grass is what you're trying to kill? Yeah. All right, we just got back. He took us out on the golf course, showed us around some of the areas he once done. We're gonna get this 50 unfolded and then we're gonna go out and we're gonna boundary some areas. We're just gonna be doing some water and really just figuring out the parameters, like what we have to do. We're gonna take this thing out and uh, boundary some areas. Is that the right area? Yep. So I see that mode area. I'm going to just fly the drone on that edge. So there's a tree right there. I could mark that as an obstacle or I could go around it like this. Waypoint added. As it's flying, Waypoint added. I'm going to add waypoints. This would be the slowest part of the process, is getting these boundaries built. So now you can see, that's where I flew. <laughs> that looks pretty damn close. Yeah, so I, I left that. Now, you see how skinny that got right there? Yeah. Based on the parameters that are already set in here, it wouldn't want to fly through that little gap. Oh, because it's too narrow? Yep, yep. too narrow. So if that's the case, you would have to manually fly it through there or something like that. But, or widen it. Yep, or widen it. So we're going to go ahead and uh, choose this. I'm going to um, put this down to 20, zero. It would still go through there. It just wouldn't spray yeah, through there. OK, so I'm going to go ahead. I'll fill it up. I'll put some product in it, and we'll send it out there and see what it does. So you can see right where it's gone. So the green, it's been gone. The yellow, it, didn't, it needs to do. And then the the boundary that it'll fly is that orange one. Okay. So there it gets going. So we're at uh, 90 microns. So if we see it's drifting too much, we can turn that up. Okay. We'll go to 300 microns now. But when you turn up your droplet, it's hard for your eyes to actually see the droplet. 
So now it's going to come back and it's going to fly that to boundary. I think we'd want to slow it down and have it because blow it down. Yeah, because your propellers are going to cause it to drift, right? I mean, just, well, uh, you see how fast it wants to go? Yeah. It's like it's doing that based on how many gallons and the speed I told it to go. So I could go in here. I'm going to put this to 12. That. A. Sir. Now you can see how the props are pushing it down. Yeah. Okay, now I'm going to boundary the fairway. See how it works for that. Okay, build that. Not sure, let's see if I change this from that. Course angle. Turn this on. Make it run the long, one of the long lines. See here, there. See what that looks like. Yeah, that looks good. All right, so we're gonna send it back up here. We're gonna put different flight parameters into it. I'm telling it to fly lower, fly slower, and we're gonna see how it does that. I'm gonna do four gallons. We could bump this up to five gallons. It's gonna really dump this load fast. Upload it and send it. Start task. Take off. Home point recorded. Five feet altitude, yeah. blowing it down in there. That curve that I'm talking about, yep. that's that fine. But that's really laying it down in there. Yeah, I like that. If you like it, I like it. Yeah. So this thing is headed back to where it took off. So it's doing this all on its own. All right, guys, just got done doing that uh, demo for the golf course. I'm telling you, it can definitely work. Like after working with some of the parameters, changing the parameters, altitudes, that type of thing, he was impressed with what the spray was able to do. So I'm telling you, it can be done. If you are looking to get into this, spray this type of stuff, get a hold of us, New Way Ag, we do the drones, we do the trailer, we do the whole nine yards. And I'm telling you what, it's just going to get better and better how this technology works. But that's all I got. We're gonna roll on to the next one. Make sure to hit the subscribe. I appreciate the support that you guys have given us here at New Ag. I'm excited where we're going. Hit that uh, like button. We'll see you guys on the next one.